Just landed in England. First time in my life in England. It's about to be 10 a.m. here. The train is like three hours away, three to four hours. Kickoff's at 3.30. We're rushing. Gotta get through passport control and then be on our way. We have no idea how the train system works, so this is gonna be fun. All right, I just got my first train ever in England. We're going to Manchester. Uh, but the only way this is possible is because I met two amazing people. That's Vera and Vlad. Oh, sorry. Vera and Vlad. Um, thank you guys so much. They helped us get around here and figure out where to go. So we're on our way to Manchester. This train station is a lot cleaner than when we got back home. I just ain't no North Penn Station. He's got nothing on New York City pigeons. Nothing. I'll take a New York City pigeon any day over this bum. We just got to London and it's like about 11. We have a, we messed up because we didn't buy our ticket to, Man to Manchester from London. I mean, it was sold out. It's not really our fault. Anyways, here we are. We're in London. The next train to Manchester leaves at 12.45 and it gets to Manchester at 3 p.m. 3. Kickoff's at 3.30. So we're cutting it close. But we got the ticket to the train. We're going to go. Uh, we have an hour to chill until our train to Manchester leaves, so we're just gonna check out London real quick. In order to save the most time possible, we decided to get a hotel to drop off our bags and not get a locker in Manchester. So we dropped off our bags, we ran back to the train station, and we were on our way to Manchester, but man, was I nervous. We left London at 1.15, meaning we would arrive in Manchester Piccadilly at 3.15, meaning we would only have 15 minutes to get to the stadium. I'm nervous, we're gonna get there right at game time, man. We're gonna have to rush when we get there. I don't want to yell because this is freaking dead silent in here, bro. Get to 1.15. Arrival time is supposed to be 3. We're going to have to hop in a taxi once we land in Manchester and get to Old Trafford. It's cutting it close. It's cutting it real close. We just got off the train. We're running. We're running. We're 10 minutes until I kick off. We're running. And we gotta find a taxi. Taxi right now. Is this for a taxi? Yeah. Taxi, taxi. It's 320. Let's see what this man can do for us. Let's see who this is. I trust this man. He's gonna, he's gonna, he's gonna get me there in time. Oh boy. Oh boy. Five minutes until kick off. Five minutes until kick off. It's gonna be right on time. Two minutes to kick off. It's currently 3:28. We're like two minutes away from the stadium. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you so much, sir. Let's go. Let's go. It's 3:30. <laughs> Yo, I am running right now. I see Old Trafford for the first time. <laughs> there it is. Oh my goodness. We have arrived. And 45. And 45. Oh, I see and 45. And 45. Okay. We got here. I'm dying. That piece here, come on. Come on, Bruno. Oh my gosh. I'm stressed out right now. 
can't express my anger, but I'm stressed to freak out. Corners of that. Come on! Freaking terrible, bro. Come on! Yeah, boom! Boom! That's terrible, man. Terrible. Despite that terrible half, I cannot believe that I'm here, bro. This thing is beautiful in person. Unreal. I mean, that's just a disgusting half. Travel 4,000 miles for this. It's unreal. Hopefully, the second half is better. First half, zero shots. Zero shots. Got some snacks for the second half. Hope it's better. Rolling down one no. Something could happen. Let's go.
a, that was a penalty, bro. Onana, Onana. It's a terrible penalty to give away, bro. Terrible. Anytime soon. Heck no, I'm, I'm taking this all in. This is. I've been dreaming about this moment, bro. I've been dreaming about this moment. That was a, that was a great game. Ooh. We made it. We made it. This is awesome, dude. Oh, yeah. Well, the kick us out. Honestly, that was phenomenal. Phenomenal game, phenomenal atmosphere. Unreal stadium. My guy right here. Go way back. Okay. Not sure what we're gonna do next. Yeah, I'm gonna show here as long as I can. Nah, that thing almost ran me over. Wow, man, I love the stadium. Cool. Look, after the game, this place gets filled up. I guess. All right, so I'm walking out here, and I see one of my followers, my man Mo, right here, and Dunny. They're from the U.S. as well. Watch a great game. They're also helping us out. They know these streets a little better than us. We're gonna, <laughs> we're gonna figure it out with them as well. Okay. Feeling one of these bucket hats over here. Not sure exactly what's next. I'm just gonna be chilling here for a while. My phone's gonna die soon though. I gotta catch a train, I gotta eat. Uh, I'll keep you guys updated though, but wow, what a day. We rushed, we got here. Crazy ass experience, but happy how everything turned out. It's a beauty. So sad leaving this place. I was able to charge my phone again. This place is awesome, man. Imagine doing this every weekend. Can't imagine. Cannot imagine.